What's up guys? Gonna be doing a channel update. Let's get started. What's up guys? I know it's been a couple of weeks since my last video. Uh, I've been doing a lot of traveling and I'm finally uh, back home. I actually have some time where I won't be uh, moving around as much. Uh, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on where things are with the various projects that I have for the channel. Uh, so first off, the uh, arcade cabinet. Uh, you might remember this from another video. This is um, a piece of quarter-inch plywood that I was uh, using, uh, or am going to be using for my template for the side of the arcade cabinet. And uh, I had it drawn out originally, and I did have some time this weekend to actually cut it out, which is um, uh, took a little time because I wanted to make sure that all these uh, parts were nice and clean because uh, this is going to be the template for the actual... Uh, MDF uh, sheets that I'm using and I wanted to make sure that this was good so that uh, the parts that I, I'm going to use in the final build are going to be good as well. Uh, I did find um, a monitor. I know that uh, I had a Samsung monitor that I was trying to fix to see if I could use that but that actually didn't pan out. But I did find um, an old HP monitor uh, local which is uh, was really cheap and worked really well and that's actually going to uh, do the trick for me. Uh, it's as uh, I should say pretty much the same size as that Samsung monitor. Uh, I don't have it handy right now. It's actually away in a box. I just want to, um, you know, and then the video where I'm actually going to be putting stuff together, I'll show it to you and, and uh, so you can get an idea of what that looks like. But uh, I'm hoping in the next uh, couple weeks, anyways, that I can get around to actually building and uh, getting parts together uh, so that I can actually have a shell. Uh, of the case so I can actually start to put the electronics inside. Now along that I do need to get uh, some more supplies for the cabinet so some wire and some connectors and the last sort of big thing I need to get is a um, controller board where all of the uh, joystick controllers and all of the uh, button wires are going to plug into that uh, then plug into the computer. Uh, I still need to buy that I will purchase that sometime soon uh, and then I can get going. So hopefully uh, I can get this um, taken care of before the weather starts to turn because um, right now it's super hot uh, but you know before we know it it's going to be super cold <laughs> so uh, I want to get this done while the weather is still decent outside. Alright so something new uh, that I'm looking into uh, there's a um, you know in the news you've seen uh, a lot about uh, just the uh, government spying program and their their prism uh, software or whatever it is that they've got uh, uh, going right now uh, and uh, security and privacy is uh, starting to be a little bit more of a concern for me and not that it it wasn't before but it's you know probably a little bit more in the uh, forefront right now based on all the news and everything that I've been seeing uh, I'm looking into uh, getting a, um, a virtual private network um, service and uh, once I decide on a provider uh, and uh, actually get software and, and get everything set up, I'll definitely put that out on video so you guys can see uh, what I'm using here. Uh, I've got a couple of buddies of mine that do networking for a living, and they both sort of recommended a couple services that I'm going to be checking out. Uh, I think I know what I'm going to be going with, but uh, I need to really give it uh, its due, uh, due time so that I can... Uh, uh, really make a good decision and like I said once I get all that taken care of uh, I'll put it on video and I'll show you what I'm going to be doing alright on to the next thing so um, I'm going to be doing some spring cleaning or summer cleaning I guess uh, on this time of the year uh, I've got some equipment and some other stuff that I'm looking to uh, get rid of and I thought it might be kind of cool uh, to show you what that process is like you know maybe go over sort of um, what I do to get stuff ready to sell. So I'll uh, uh, think about making a video like that. I definitely have a lot of stuff that I want to get rid of. Uh, the money will be good for some uh, for, for projects, which I'm always looking to do. And uh, I think that will be uh, something of interest. So look for that sometime in the future. All right, well, there's a little story about this battery. Uh, and there's actually uh, four in total. And uh, a couple of you guys have seen them in the corner of my videos because they kind of peek in. Um, in the last couple of videos that I've done. Uh, these are indeed uh, batteries that came out of a UPS. Uh, somebody gave me one and the UPS itself was bad but the batteries inside were still good so I kept the batteries so I had some backups. 
um, and uh, I made a video of that process uh, but you know uh, you guys know me uh, I'm not a perfect uh, youtuber and uh, I inadvertently deleted the video uh, that went with it So, um, I ended up with some good batteries, but no video <laughs> of it. Uh, and these are just sitting around. Uh, I have a small uh, APC battery backup that takes one of these guys, and I'm using that to keep these guys charged up. So, uh, I have some spares when I need them. Alright, that's going to wrap it up for this update video. Um, so, I got a question for you guys. You guys always leave me comments, which is great. I appreciate it. Um, how's your summer going? Uh, I know mine's been really hectic, so uh, I'm interested to see how things are going with you guys. Uh, definitely like and subscribe. Helps me out a ton. Follow me on Twitter and Google Plus for updates on new videos and just for updates. Um, I've been using Twitter a little bit more often um, nowadays, especially since I've been on the road. Um, so, you'll get updates there as to how things are going. Uh, so, definitely follow me there. And uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. See you next time.